<laughs> what is up guys Capgun here one any gamer bring you guys some more black ops 2 gameplay and wow I actually recently gained a lot of subscribers if you watched my video that was uploaded on machinima respawn where I went 30 plus rounds in die rise zombies and I gave you guys the hand cam so I showed you guys how I use the controller with one hand that's how I have to play it's not an option I have to game with one hand I've been doing it for a long time since actually Nintendo era and I've been playing video games I guess since I was five and you know playing on the arcade when I was tall enough so that's basically how I you know use the controller with one hand if you know you've seen the gameplay I have other gameplays if you guys want to check that out I go even more in detail on how I use the controller if you're wondering and I have like over 500 videos so you know Go check them out if you like. I greatly appreciate it and welcome to my channel. I mainly post Call of Duty on my gameplay, but I try to give you guys some variety of, you know, different games. And when I play Call of Duty, I also give you a variety of weapons. So I don't always post the same weapon in every gameplay. I try to mix it up so that way you guys will be entertained. And I try to mix up the kill streaks. So I don't always use the same kill streaks every gameplay. Uh, this gameplay I actually decided to put on the K9 unit, which I haven't used in a while. And actually I got this gameplay today, and I'm using the SMR. The SMR is a very effective assault rifle. If you haven't used this weapon, oh my gosh, definitely put it on. It's basically the new FAL with Select Fire. It is very effective. You don't even have to use Select Fire if you don't want to. I just prefer it so then that way I can always you know, get those kills a little bit easier. Uh, but this gun is definitely hands down probably one of your go-to weapons in the assault category. If you haven't used it, definitely try it out. Also, it's actually the last gun that I have to unlock uh, the gold with to get, I believe, the diamond camo. So once I'm done with the SMR, I'll finally unlock diamond camo. And this is, you know, on PS3. I've been playing primarily on PS3, but... I always get on Xbox for the map packs and give you guys some gameplay on there. So I actually give you variety on both consoles and that way you can see, you know, what I do on each system. And I'm, you know, higher prestige actually on PS3 than Xbox, but uh, it doesn't really matter. I still have the, you know, same stuff that's pretty much unlocked. I still go for the same stuff and, you know, I just had to figure it out when I get back on the system. I'm like, oh, I forgot I don't have that unlocked, so I have to unlock it. So I recently unlocked the K9 unit, uh, this Prestige. So I was like, heck, I'll throw it on this gameplay, see if I, you know, get some doggies, get some puppies. And I got some puppies in this gameplay. So uh, hopefully you guys enjoy this. Actually, this would have been a flawless game. I'm really disappointed that I didn't get the flawless. I should have just hid in the corner or something. Um, at the end of the gameplay, you're going to see it. I just couldn't believe it happened. I just, I was just really upset about it. But, heck, this was an awesome gameplay, and I hope you guys enjoy it. Now, what's going to be coming out here pretty soon is the new DLC, if you guys haven't heard, which probably most people have, the new DLC, Uprising, the second DLC for Black Ops 2. It's going to have four new multiplayer maps and one zombie map. It doesn't include a new weapon, which is a big surprise to me. I mean, we got the Peacekeeper last go around, so that's a little unfortunate. But the new maps look crazy. They really put a lot of detail in it. Uh, Magma has basically a volcano on the map, which is going to be crazy. There's going to be a lot of lava everywhere. We got Encore, Vertigo, and Studio. Studio is really what everybody has been talking about. And the reason for that is it's actually the same map from Black Ops. Firing Range. If you played Firing Range, you know what I'm talking about. Crazy map. Awesome. Small, confined map. Get a lot of kills, especially with kill streaks, because there's not a lot of places you can hide, so that's even better. So Swarm Galore on that map, of course. It's going to be really intense, and I'm really pumped up to play on that map. And then the zombie map, Mob of the Dead. Mob of the Dead is going to be located on Alcatraz. Alcatraz is basically a closed-down prison. And if you've seen the movie The Rock, uh, that movie is insane. It's got Nicolas Cage and Sean Connery. One heck of a movie if you haven't seen it. If you're old enough, it's rated R. Definitely go watch it. You'll definitely enjoy it. And here I got my double doggies. I got my puppies again. And I'm just trying to be very careful because I want to get, you know, actually 
my flawless gameplay. I'm trying to go flawless here. So I hit back here. I'm like, okay, so I'll use my load star. I'll stay in the back. I'll be safe. You know, no problems. I'm still flawless. I wasn't even looking at the scoreboard because I was getting a little nervous towards the end. And I think that's reason why I failed right here. Watch this. Yeah, that sucked. I ran out of ammo and my aim was just horrible. So, unfortunately, it wasn't flawless, but I went 41-1. and Thank you for watching. Always leave it a rating deserves. Capgun out.